In this video, I'll be demonstrating how to do a split mat updo. To prep the hair, I'm using Rockaholic Shine Blast, which you're welcome to use your favorite smoothing cream just to smooth out the ends and to get rid of any flyaways. At the crown of her head, I'm going to create a little volume just by backcombing in small sections. Using your finger or rat tail combs, split the hair into two equal sections. You can secure one section of hair by clipping it to the side or just placing it over the shoulder. Working with one section of hair, I'm going to split that section into two equal parts one more time. And then I'm going to take the two sections and tie them together as if I'm about to tie my shoe. Then you'll want to tie one to three more knots, depending on the length of hair you're working with. Once I've made a chain of knots, I'm going to roll the hair under and tuck the ends underneath the hair and then secure it with a bobby pin. With the second section of hair, repeat the chain of knots and then roll that section of hair under as well, tucking under any loose ends and securing it with another bobby pin. Combien You can easily secure a bobby pin by separating the bobby pin using your fingertips, lacing the hair through the two ends, sliding the bobby pin with the side flat against your head and pushing it in with your fingertips. Once the hair is secure and your bobby pins are in place, take an overall look at the hair to make sure that it's balanced and symmetrical, and use a few extra bobby pins to make some adjustments where needed. For extra hold, you can use a finishing spray or a mild hairspray. And then your hairstyle is complete and it's ready to wear. This hairstyle works on hair that is curly, straight, or wavy, as long as it's just above the shoulders or longer. The only supplies you'll need for this hairstyle is smoothing cream, rat tail comb, bobby pins, and finishing spray is optional. 